tell you about this kid I met while you were gone. Made some real waves of his own about town. Splish splash. Yeah, so there I am, all right? It's about 6 a.m. or so. I'm sipping the morning coffee down at the harbor like I always do. Early bird, Mike, as they sometimes say. Early bird? Dude, I went to bed like three hours earlier. Anyway, no word of introduction, no context. He comes up to me and he says, excuse me, do you know a place where sailors hang out? I'm getting sailors. Yeah, sailors. Sailors. So I'm like, I don't, I don't know. I don't have any clue, but maybe there's a, you know, we're by the harbor, so maybe that's a good place to ask around. Okay, okay, all right. All right, so lo and behold, the kid turns around and immediately asks the 10 or 12 people down the line, bouncing from one to the other like a pinball, where are their sailors? Where are their sailors? Have you seen sailors? Anybody seen sailors? And I'm like, enough with the sailors already. You're in a harbor. They're around here somewhere. Oh, poor kid was probably lost or something, huh? I don't know. He just looked like... More like he was on a mission of some sort. I mean, you should have seen him. He had this leather jacket on with this big tiger emblem on it. Real slick. That's not even the half of it. A couple days later, I'm over at Hip Hop Shrimp, wolfing down the usual. There's the kid. That's right. There's the kid. Except this time, he's asking about a warehouse. Think he found his sailors. I don't know, but maybe they keep the sailors in the warehouse. I don't know. (laughs) He was too busy looking for some dumpy warehouse this time, so he asked every person on the street in about two minutes flat. Just bam, 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 bam. We're talking like 50 plus people. Where is the warehouse? Well, it sounds like the kid gets around. I know. And that's not even the worst part. You know that alley behind my house? Get out of here. So I'm back grilling one night a couple days later, and there he is. Oh, tiger jacket strikes again. Yeah, there I am. Steaks about the sizzle. Picturesque Hawaiian sunset. Most beautiful pale blue and orange skyline you ever saw. I'm drinking hand and... Getting ready to hoist it, and then whoosh, this kid comes galloping up the street full sprint with the most heroic stride this side of the red, white, and blue. It's like he's on a paper route. He's hitting every single one of my neighbors up with questions about how he can hitch a boat ride out east, and where can he get a boat ride out east? And the next thing I see, he's beelining straight for me again. Oh, sounds like he got a lot of time on his hands. (laughs) It sure does. You know know we got airplanes out here? I would imagine so, but maybe he doesn't because, frankly, at this point, I was so scared I dove into my pool to hide. Aloha shirt, slippers, and all. (laughs) Oh, you crazy, Mike. Look, it was quite a flight. This kid was a force of nature. Scared the living you-know-what out of me. Way too intense for this old Burbank original, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, sounds like it, cuz. Oh, hope he made it back to the mainland. Yeah, let's hope, because, uh, kid, uh, if you're listening, you know, best of luck for me and Big P. Hope you find what you're looking for, and stay away from my house! Yeah, stay away from Mike! You should hurry.